Jessica, if you're taking A-level physics and just coming up to half term, what can you be doing over half term to really get ahead with your physics and to really start to improve your current um, grade, whatever that might be. So um, the most important thing really will be for you to have a rest over half term, but then assuming you've got a little bit of time and you're quite aspirational and quite committed to improving, then I would strongly suggest that you get started on doing some A-level physics question practice. And um, you can start this topic by topic and uh, just by taking sets of questions um, by topic and having a go at those in turn. And nothing wrong with doing these open book, so you can have your, um, your textbooks open and your notes open and be using those. Um, and then the main thing will be for you to then look at your responses carefully, mark them carefully against the mark scheme, and you're looking for the gaps in your responses compared to what was required in the mark scheme. And identifying the gaps will go a long way then to improving your um, capability with exam questions on, on that particular topic. And it's quite a difficult thing to do. It's quite challenging for students to do that on their own at home, but it is a necessary um, step. Um, students typically don't get um, the practice that they need. Um, it's really, A-level physics is really all about um, question practice. And it's all about, really all about the student's ability to apply their knowledge um, in questions and really being able to unravel the particular question and solve the problem that that question is, is asking. Um, so if you need any help with that, then um, I have a few things that I could offer to, to support um, your son or daughter or you if you're the students. Um, first thing is I have um, a workbook pack which covers year 12 and year 13 topics, which is available on my website. Um, these are sets of questions which will be ideal for you to practice um, uh, together with the mark schemes. Um, they're all A-level questions and you'll also have the benefit of my annotations um, on, on those uh, questions as well. So you can see really the, the steps involved. Um, sometimes the mark scheme can be a little bit tricky to understand exactly what was required because the mark scheme is written for uh, the person marking it and not for the student. So you'll have the benefit of my student-friendly annotations on those questions um, to help you to see what it was you needed to do.